Hey everyone, what's up? So right now we're in Inkscape, which is a free program to download. There'll be a link below for anyone that wants to check that out. This is a pretty awesome program and what we're going to be doing is taking a drawing of Tanuki Toad and making it kind of like that one that you saw to the side, putting it into vectors. So you start with your tracing in one layer and then you start an outline layer where you're going to start building this outline and stretching it, fitting it, moving the contours of the vector lines until you got the right shape that you need. So right here I'm starting with drawing that, that cool mushroom hat that he's wearing and then going on to do the face first to make points and then to stretch out those vectors to fit the curvature of his face, of his ears, of the hat, um, of everything in this picture. With a vector you're able to make it as big or as small as you want and it won't lose any quality which is a really cool thing. Lots of math. It was a really awesome experience. It was really cool. Being able to serve my mission and being able to strengthen the people in the place I was called to and being able to get to know some awesome people and kind of have another family there. On my mission, I discovered how much I love to help people and, and inspire people. And something I was always inspired about was, was art and watching artists, especially Disney. So I wanted to kind of get into this thing, showing you how to create art pretty easily and for free. So it's pretty cool. And in drawing this, I wanted to stay true to the design that Mephilis designed but also be able to figure out some of those things. Figuring out the eyes was a lot of fun. <laughs> and it's a ton of fun working with this. I love graphic design and I'm gonna be doing all of the members of the Tanuki Toad team. So this is kind of the first episode of a little mini series called Drawing the Team. I've always loved Nintendo and making these characters with Mephilus was super fun. And just me being able to figure them out a little bit and to, to make those pixelated versions that we used in one of the, the specials, that was a ton of fun too with the Q&A. So if you haven't seen that, you should go check that out. But after making the outlines, you wanna make another layer that's called color. And you trace just dot by dot, not the same way, um, but just really like jagged or whatever. And you're gonna put that behind, the layer behind. But yeah, Inkscape is a really cool program just to be able to do vector art. I've done a little bit of logo design with that, so it's been super cool too. If you have any questions about how to use that, just let me know. But in the rest of this video, I'm just going through kind of repeating that same process of making an outline, making a color, filling in that color, putting it in the right place, and getting all that figured out. And something that I've learned about graphic design and other design aspects too is it always helps to have a reference, to have an idea, to have some kind of vision, something that's fueling you, something that's giving you that inspiration. And that's why I have like a picture of me and a picture of Tanuki Toad from when I first did it and not kind of just going into it blindly, but having things to look at, to reference, that helps a ton. And when I was on my mission and just being able to hear from him helped me to keep going, because it's, it's hard, it's super hard. Um, there were some times on my mission where I was like, just didn't even have a car, just had a bike, and was biking through the snow in a really cold place. Not like super cold, the coldest it got was about five degrees. But riding on a bike, that wind, that wind chill just cuts right through you. Those experiences are really cool because it was really that refiner's fire. It helped me to become a better person and life is still hard. But I realized on my mission that, that I can do hard things. All of these things are making me into a better person. Which actually relates a ton to the process of making this drawing, just putting points there, lines here. And starting off with something that looks pretty raw, pretty weird, like just a triangle. And shaping that, figuring all these things out, throughout our lives we're molded and shaped to become something so much better. 
to have this finished product that is amazing and we can be like wow that's me and alike with to the reference drawing we all have a vision we all have an idea of what we want to create what we want to be and it's definitely going to come from the people around us and also from god he's the one that's molding us shaping us refining us he is the master designer um, sitting there putting a line here and a dot there figuring all these things out so that we come out to be that masterpiece. Thank you all so much for all of your support and for who you are. Remember that each and every one of us is needed and that you're needed. Y'all have a blessed day. Bye.